and welcome back to flexible games where we are playing surviving mars and uh, i've got another shuttle with another set of recruits coming in for me here um this 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 area over here is actually well populated um a lot of retirees oh my goodness Whee! and great so the vast majority of the people that I just brought in are botanists. Yes, we so desperately need botanists. A lot of them are going to try to fix themselves. Maybe we'll have a few stop by the college to uh, get some things and stuff. But I need food. Like food is kind of important here, people. And by not giving me food, you are gonna just you're just gonna kill yourselves i mean that's just that's just the breaks of it right um it, it's not a good thing to uh to deny that you guys need to grow some food so i don't know what the reluctance is um so i wanted to say that if i were to mod this game if i were to mod it the, the number one thing that I would want to mod are the so-called recruits to make the trip. Because you're telling me out of the possible population of Earth that you're going to you're going to bring in people who are like chronically unhealthy. Um, you know, the first people who come here um i don't think are gonna have you know they're not gonna be alcoholics they're not gonna be you know they're gonna be well vet you know maybe as the population goes up that may change but uh yeah i i i would definitely 100 percent change how uh the or the uh the stats of all the people because i just do not believe that the first people to Mars are going to be a bunch of like alcoholic hypochondriacs. <laughs> you know, they're they're going to be mentally stress tested. They're going to be physically stress tested, and uh, yeah, they're they're not going to break down in the first the first sign of trouble. Why did this load up with exports? I guess we had. Quite a lot, yeah. Well, we're doing pretty good over here. Um, how many does this have left in it? I don't even know. Anyway, we're getting enough, and uh, yeah, this is actually doing really, really well. Believe it or not, we're actually making quite a lot of machine parts now. And how are electronics doing? Electronics are actually not doing too bad. Um, not doing too bad at all so i'm a little bit more comfortable bringing in a bunch of botanists for all the food that we're going to need i may even want another farm i may even want another farm let's actually build another farm because you know it's going to be needed. where it would be a life support yeah life support. um we're going to do that I don't think there's anybody unemployed. Let's send this guy back. Uh, check our research. Oh, we have uh, quite a bit that we can do here. Um, uh, funding. We want a little bit of that. Subsurface heater. Increase the local climate in cold areas and protects nearby buildings from cold waves. Luckily, I haven't, I haven't hit a cold wave in a while. Um, so yeah, might as well do that. Atomic accumulator. Don't even know if I want to deal with that. Fission, no fusion reactor. Uh, that might be pushing our luck. I would like something with dealing with colonists. Ooh. 
unlocks the import greenhouse gases. Capture ice asteroids. Accessible via planetary view. Yeah, I think that might be good. Import some uh, carbon dioxide from Venus, maybe? I mean, that'd be a long... Oh, man, that'd be a long trip. That'd be like two years in space just to bring just to bring me some gas. For now, I kind of want to dip my... I kind of want to dip my toe in the other thing. Now that we have a little bit of temperature, there's no telling what this actually means. Um, like this here, terraforming effect, 0.01% per, per soul. Um, consume seeds to plant wild vegetation. Plants will either wither or grow depending on local soil quality and global temperature. Improves global vegetation if it's less than 40%. Doesn't work during dust storms and toxic floods. That's understandable. Um, but consume seeds. It does increase local soil quality. So maybe. Ooh, that's a pretty big area. You know, let's 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 see. We, it needs a cable connection. Uh, should we terraform that down a little bit first? Uh, where is our RC command? Oh, it looks like somebody's already on the case. Okay, good. Uh, unfortunately, that's probably going to fill up. Yeah, 165. Yeah. I really wish, really wish there was something we could do. Rock formation. Well, that uses rock, I guess. But it makes the area not usable and not buildable. Large dumping site. How about right there? Auto save. Funding received. Ooh, yeah, rare metals. So you guys are welcome for that. Uh, let's build some cables. Power cables. And then terraforming forestation. Not enough power. That doesn't make sense. Doesn't it say it used 10? Yeah, 10. So I've got these things, which is giving me 20.4. So there's 10 here, and this 10 here. That should be plenty. Uh, all right. Still doing good there. We're doing really good on fuel. Polymers, not so hot. Um, I may want to open a second shift up with that. Uh, what else are we needing? There's a little bit. Hey, sir. He needs to recharge. Oh, wow. Insufficient seeds. Only have 13. Harvest. Okay. Uh, now, are we... What, what is it spritzing down on? Is it, are those supposed to be the seeds? New anomalies. Well, that's good. Where is... Keep forgetting about this guy. I know there's a way to, like, make him autonomous, but... 
Uh, okay. As wild vegetation improves, sporadic vegetation booms will occur. Okay, well that's that's cool. Ooh, is that a thing? <gasps> I see green. I see green. But what is this? Uh oh. Anomaly analyzed. There's more to the barren environment. Lake crafting mega storage. A veritable treasure trove of. Lake crafting, unluxuration of artificial lakes. Evaporating water improves local soil quality and water on Mars. Okay. And what was the other one? Something. No, not rover. Refineries and factories upgrade. Performance increased by 20%. Oh, that's a good one. 10 grand. Um, I've got all the ones in biotech all the way down. Geoscape dome. 400 concrete. 300 polymers. Ouch. That one hurts. Mega storage. Large water tank. I mean, sure. You'd think that. I don't know. I see a little green. I see a little green on Mars. That is glorious. Oh, there's some more. I mean, I don't know how good it is going to be but look at that little 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 spots of green already um i'm gonna need some more drones too um i'm out of food i am out of food how close are you guys to giving me more food Oh yeah, uh, quinoa. Growth time two souls, and then we want fruit tree eight souls, corn five souls. Quinoa is uh, neutral on the soil quality. I need to bump the soil quality up. So for now, I'll do cover crops. And soybeans, 40, five souls of 40, five souls of 55, five souls of 70. That's actually, that's actually pretty darn good. Let's do corn. It's a lot of, it's, I mean, it doesn't make any sense. Five souls, five years to grow some corn, like. What? How does that work? Um, so, we need... Wow, we're minus 32 power? Okay, uh... Let's do... Oh, what is... What is this? Yeah, we gotta... We gotta feed the beast here. Um, lake. Large lake, huge lake. Huh. I mean, we could put a lake in over here, maybe, and it would improve the soil quality. See, this is why I flattened it first. I didn't want to deal with flattening a mountain after the fact. Oh, this guy's probably... No, this guy's probably done. And there was another anomaly... there get him moving we have a food shortage uh okay cargo rocket
Five seeds for 60 million? Good lord. Man, those are expensive. Uh, there we go. Launch. Sector scan. We have a food shortage. Yeah, I, I am aware of that. If we could just get this harvest in, that would be great. We have a food shortage. Thank you. You can tell me one more time? Please? I mean, come on. Seriously? Boy, they starved just instantly, didn't they? Our colonists are starving. Troubling. Yeah, it's troubling. There we go. There's some food. Resources are low. Thanks. We got a hundred food out of that whole endeavor. There we go. Is everybody happy again? That should tide us over until the ship gets here. Until this farm becomes more productive. And that's another 22 food. Good, good, good. I am going to need... I need some more power. We have a food shortage. Why, why are there still starving colonists? I literally... We literally have food. There's New text. The barren environs of the red planet that meets the compact island. hangers. Veritable treasure trove of undiscovered knowledge and wonder. Uh, compact so hangers. Stop know, talking. Uh, compact hangers and home collective. Home collective, I think, was one. Residential building upgrade increases the service comfort. Oh, I like that. 15,000 um, and the other one was compact hangers the maximum was increased by 6 15,000 those are so expensive I mean those are going to take those are going to take decades to do What are you doing? I, I have no idea what he was doing outside. But we should have solved the food crisis. Alright, where's my shuttle? There it is. Land you. I do not know why my polymers are not, not doing it here. Uh, polymer consumption. We gotta open up the other shift. There's some more food. That's the first major food crisis Reset that I've hit. Complete. There, now the, the drones will at least be able to deliver more things and stuff. I I, I brought a bunch of drones because I was uh, at the last meteor shower killed a bunch of my drones, and uh, ironically enough, drone printing just got done. 
And yeah, I brought in some more seeds just to keep this thing operational. And all we get is a little, all we get is little green, little green stains on the little skid marks on the, on the planet here. And we are hurting on. Look at the power. Wow. Uh, why, why is our power consumption suddenly spiking? Um, we are going to take a few of you guys and assign to there. I'm going to take a bunch of you guys, maybe assign to you. You can be assigned to that. what they were doing. Parting tourists, drone. I still have two drones. Let's shrink that service area. There's the other one. Uh... Wasn't there one over here? Yeah, I know I I know I'm I lost a couple out of that. Alright. Um Joe Drones, you can return back home. Alright, so I guess that's gonna be it for terraforming for a while. I mean, we're, we're continually warming us up. Um, I'd rather not trigger toxic rains. What is this? An unknown object on a rapid trajectory from Earth towards Mars. Uh, observation is an artificial origin. Pesos and semantics. Okay. Detected to be inbound towards Mars from Earth. Well, great. Are you going to give me a status of what the heck that is? Soul 160. Mystery log. Okay, I guess that's I can't I can't get rid of that. Um, what is? I like these to go up here. There we go. Gather up ye metals thank you for the money any any it's coming at us depending on when they launched and where in orbit we were it could take three to three months to two years to get to us um yeah there's actually quite a bit of metal up here what is that polymers oh look at that i didn't even know there were polymer deposits that's 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 awesome. Like, is there other deposits that I've missed? Uh, what? Oh, that is a metal. I think that was an asteroid, that one. Uh, yeah, I don't... I'm not in there. Nah, I'm not seeing really anything else. Got some neon green specs coming in. All right, what? You are on seeds. You are on. Oh yeah, I gotta. I've gotta replenish the soil quality at least with one one cycle. Still, no people. I don't have specialties on here. How about an evening shift, maybe? Hmm. 
right, you are full. You are. You're both full. So you come down here. You're my storage. I'm kind of chewing through a lot of uh, a lot of metal for all my machine parts, but I am very glad that we finally. Sector scanned. Research complete. Milestone achieved. All sectors scanned. All right, 2,500 research. Man, that that actually completed a few researches. Um, let's let's see. I may want some social stuff. Um, medics, no. Russian copyrights. Creative disposition. Art workshop. Uh -huh. Art. Consumes polymers. But I don't see any positive out of that. Do they get comfort? Or anything? Home collective. I think we want to. I think we want to do this. Um. Lake crafting, domeless farming. Fully grown plants are harvested for food by drones. Well, let's do lakes first, and then we'll do farms. I want to try to get. I want to try to get Mars as green as possible. Planetary survey. Uh, was that was that a new one that I didn't see? No. Water, oxygen, and power storage capacities. Oh, I didn't even see this was here. That that would have been a nice one to get. Rejuvenation treatment. Yeah, I'm not sure. Mystery log. Still still don't know what's coming. Uh, RC Explorer. There is one research I think that gives us anomalies or gives us more anomalies. Oh wait. Uh, any other ones? Is that an anomaly? That's a vista. Just seeing if we have any more. No, I don't think so. So, and then after you're done with those two, come back a little bit. Okay, uh, where are we with everything else? Uh, maybe I should do. Heck yeah, I'm gonna do quinoa first. Uh, let's Anomaly upgrade. Analyzed. Upgrade that. We're going to upgrade you. We're going to. Decreases workplaces by one. Nice. Upgrade. Upgrade. That should help keep these things really, really going strong. Anomaly analyzed. New text. To the barren environs of the red planet that meets the eye. A veritable treasure trove of undiscovered knowledge and wonder. So long as you know where to look. Uh, behavioral melding. Martian-born resilience. 
the Martian network. New spire building, network node. Um, wow, that is 20 grand, 20K. Behavioral melding. Sanatorium upgrade. Uh, replaces removed flaws with random perks. That would be nice. Martian board resilience. Martian board not taking sanity damage and working in outdoor buildings. Um, wow. Okay. Disasters. That is. That's big. But it takes years to do that. Alright. Are these upgraded yet? Uh, electronics. We want to make sure we have like 10 electronics. Because they have to come in from over here. I think. Yeah. There they are. And then how is this doing? Not too bad. I mean, we are technically making more than we're using by just a very tiny amount. Now, are these are people not traveling for school? Marsgate Esocorp, great. Mission controls received a direct communique from Esocorp, one of Earth's largest tech conglomerates. It reads, uh, please be advised that object, whatever, 6EZ3 will be operating within a respectful distance of our mission. You are not to approach under any circumstance, under threat of legal and other punitive measures. Nothing was added in the Wow. Do their best to put anyone at the bottom of this. Ah, uh, okay. Well, I, you, if I don't stay away, what are you going to do about it? Like, I'm on Mars. What? You know, you, you go outside and you trip on the ground and you're, you're going to be killed. Um, <laughs> okay. I think I might want to shut this metal extractor down and move metal extracting up here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I want to do that. So, let's shut her down. Even though, yes, I would eke out a little bit more. I mean, it's using power, it's using maintenance. I don't, I don't think. Uh, let's shut her down and then salvage. And we're going to come up here. And we're going to say, hey, uh, production, metals extractor. Resources are low. Food is low again? No. That can't be. All right, there's the metals right next to it, which is good. Um, yeah, look at how many metals we've already got. Unload, unload. And I want to make sure, yeah, desired amount is good. Let's get back up here. Clear up some of the free stuff we've got. These guys should be well on their way to building. Wow, is this out too? Oh. Wow, this is out too. Wow, okay. 
That's unfortunate. Resources are low. Um, maybe I should build a food thingy over here. It did land near us? Well, in that case, uh, how much power do you need? You need five. I'm, I'm trying to take everybody's advice and uh, keep my power and some of my other life support things um, you know, keep them uh, sort of isolated. <coughs> um, so where where did they land? Uh, let's see. Really? Triple. Triple Dust Devils. That's, that's great, everybody. That's just great. Uh, yeah, I'm not seeing... There's no indication. It says they landed nearby, but... Maybe they landed off map or something. Oh. Hello. It's just going to roam the surface, I guess. That's fine. All right, now these should be upgraded. Excellent. Excellent. Good. Good. Excellent. And we just got some more vegetables. Start, start unlocking some more of these like work shifts. Resources are low. What? I can't be it. I just had a. I just had a harvest. Resources All right. Are low. Resource? Are, really? No. Yeah, I. Not sure what. Is going on here this guy is uh so quality is going up why why do you think the mountains are developing more than anything that's interesting anyway that is going to do it for this episode and thank you for watching and i will see you next time